Hey what's up? Ultramag64 here, and today guys I bring you more of the My Little Pony game from Gameloft. Now, last time we le left off, left, 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 left off, last time we left off, we got all the, the quests done, all, all the things are done, everything's done, it's all done, we're done with the game, we're, bye guys, we're, we're, we're finishing the episode off, we're done, we're done. No, but um, we did get a lot done, and I actually finished another quest, or I think, actually two quests, I think, yeah, yeah, I, I did two quests, I think, and I, all I need now is the, uh, the magic shard thing that I need to get, but anyway, let's see what Applejack's got for us, and then we'll head to Ponyville and etc., and, and get more stuff done, I think, yeah, you're still being worked on, wait, can I afford the carrot cake now? Ah, five gems short, dang it. Okay, but you... Oh, yeah, I forgot. I, I completely forgot about that quest. We'll work on that. We'll finish that quest off uh, as well this week. But let's see what Applejack's got in the Crystal Empire. Between you and me, that Crystal Pony, the Empire sure cleaned itself up nice. I figured all we gotta do is get a couple of road lights and down and all that stuff. Yeah, lay all the roads down. I already did! I've laid so many roads! Like, look at this place! I don't know where else to lay road. I don't think I have any more road to lay. Okay, uh, one, two, three. Any more over there? I don't think I can lay any more over there. Oh, oh, four, five. There we go. Yeah, might as well go around this tree. Why not? We're already there. There we go. Boom! Look at that! Alright, anything else, AJ? Nope. Nope, okay, so we are clearing through the Crystal Empire. Alright, so let's go ahead and slam our heads against the train station until the train comes, and then we're gonna go to Ponyville after, you know, that severe train accident. That wasn't and the train conductor's fault, it was all our fault. But that's not what we tell the police. Alright, so anyway, let's go ahead and grab all this stuff. I forgot if there was anything I needed to do. Nope, okay, cool. Awesome, so... Then what we'll do... How many of the... No, 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 get away. Uh, not the gems. How many... Thing... Because, yeah, we had to do... Oh, well, we still have to do, like, a bunch of those. Jeez. Alright, so I'm going to save up a little bit more, because it's a lot... Well, I guess we could clear out the Crystal Empire, because that's a lot cheaper than... I think doing Ponyville at this point, because Ponyville's like getting up there in price. So it might be cheaper to go and clear out some of the Crystal Empire a little bit more. Uh, or we could do, oh, we could do Sweet Up Lakers. I think Sweet Up Lakers is still like dirt cheap. <laughs> Get it? Because it's mostly dirt. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, granted that place has the least amount of stuff. Also a new pony came. Uh, this lady. I really don't care about her. Really don't. How much are you? We're so expensive, we won't even show you. Uh, that's too much for my blood. You're not- You're never getting got, lady. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't care much for you, and I, st I still don't, so... N no. You're just... You're not my priority. Okay, so we got 53. We've almost got enough to finish the raw raw quest of stuff that I don't need, like the carrot cake that is completely useless. It's okay. Okay, so let me go test something at the Crystal at the Crystal Empire. The Sweet Apple Acres, not Crystal Empire. Completely not. It's the exact opposite of the Crystal Empire. All right, so let's see how much. Could you could you move? Two thousand. Wait, is that twenty-five? Yeah, screw it. Cool. I mean that. Yeah, like there's no way this is gonna clear out the quest. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll have to figure that out. I, that's still going to be, like, that's our long-term goal, though. I don't think, like, we're not going to get that done by the end of this. I mean, I guess we could, but that's going to, like, dwindle our war chest of, of gem, of, not gems, bits. Because, good gravy, we don't have a war chest of bits. We don't have that. I still have to figure out how I'm going to acquire magic shards in the Crystal Empire. Like, I don't know how we're going to do that. Just yet. Like, I haven't figured it out yet. Okay, so let's see... 
What else we need to do? We need to go over here. And then... Because, like, mainly that's all we have to do is just mess with Rara and the holiday update. Which someone actually said that the, uh, the holiday update is for, uh, in some places of the world, like, Christmas lasts like 25 days or something like that. And, uh, that's impressive. I mean, if I had 25 days of Christmas, good gravy, I'd just be a happy, happy boy. But, uh, you know, unfortunately, that, that, that's kind of the problem with Christmas. It only happens once a year. But that one time a year is real good. Alright, so we'll mix all that up, get more element shard generators going. So that we can get more element shards for no reason at all, because I have stockpiled those things to oblivion and I don't need more. I've also noticed, like, the Crystal Empire still has not given me, like, any reason to buy a shop. I bought a shop last time. We, we bought a shop. I might as well go back there and show you guys. So, last time we bought a shop, it's over here. Yeah, over here is gonna, I think, it's gonna be the di the business district. And we're gonna have, like, I don't know, something else up here. But I, I don't know what that, I haven't got it all planned out yet. But, like, I think here's gonna be, like, a, a nice little markety area with, with two sides of, of venues or whatever. I don't think we have enough things for what I want to do, though. Let me check. Hang on. Uh, wrong way. Okay. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Oh, uh, that's gonna be tricky. I mean, we could put the pie cart out there. I guess we could remodel. Like, we could change up. Like, if we put the horseshoe shop and stuff, like, there's just so much room for so little stuff. Like, what am I going to do with all this room? What's the point of unlocking it all if there's, like, no reason? That's the thing I don't get. Like, is there a lot of ponies in the Crystal Empire? I didn't think there were that many. Oops. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 ponies? So, I mean, I guess, but that's that's only accounting for if, like, each pony has a house, which I doubt highly, like, the the little fillies and foals probably don't have a house of their own, I, I would hope not. But, I mean, I don't know. Like, I, I just don't know how... Why so much room? Like, I guess you could expand by bringing more ponies in, but... I mean... I just don't know what you're gonna do. Where's Flurry Heart, by the way? Has anyone noticed that little pink ball of fluff is not in this at all yet? Are we gonna get an another expansion to where, like, it's... It's gonna have Flurry Heart? Or wait, did Flurry Heart already come out? Am I just missed her? I don't remember. But I'm pretty sure she didn't come out. I, rem I think I'd remember talking about her. Right? Are they a season behind still? Ooh, what if they bring the changelings along? I mean, that kind of make things a little awkward at the Crystal Empire currently with all the twiggles, you know, walking around. But, I mean, on the bright side, that'd give them a chance to... Uh, can I go over there? Nope, it's... Well, it's down, so I, I can't show you on this map. But down here, there's a uh, uh, an area called the the Netherlands, I think, or the Wasteland. I can't remember. I'm probably gonna call it the Wasteland because Fallout. But uh, anyway, there's there's this place where you uh, where the changelings are at, so they could unlock that as a city and then have you make more changelings. Like have have the changelings come along and be like, hey, what up? You know, we're well, I, I guess you'd have to go through a quest line first of, of monotonous nonsense before you got to the to the real meat and potato butters of changelings being reformed. But I'm just saying that, hey, you know, it'd be cool to have just a little bit of a quest. Okay, are you going to do nothing? Yeah, you go, you go do that. And you go do that, I think. Uh, there we go. Okay, so what all did you need? Okay, so we got, we need ten more of you. I still don't know how we're going to get that, so, and we also need to get the rubber ducks at some point. So, we'll figure that out. This is going to take a while. But, uh, like, honestly, like, they could do a thing with the changelings. Like, wouldn't that be neat? I mean, I guess, well, I guess technically they're going to have to wait until the show tells us what, they, what the changelings are doing. Like, are we even going to get closure on that? Changelings, they just reformed and just kind of sat there at, at the ruins of Christmas's castle, just kind of like, cool, uh, 
New king, what do? I don't freaking know. What do I look like? A king? I mean, technically. Well, I'm not. I've got giant moose antlers. Does that look like a kingly thing to you? Well, I mean, sir, we had a, a, a chancellor named Puddinghead, so I kind of figured that the rules of hierarchy kind of just went out the window centuries ago. You make a good point. You know what? You should be king. I shouldn't be king. Why can't you be king? Because you have the moose antlers. What if I chopped these off and gave them to you? Well, that'd be really weird, and I don't feel like you should do that. Because I'm pretty sure they're attached to your body. And then the whole kingdom just goes into disarray and discord. And then just everything blows up. And we all lived happily ever after with no more changelings until Chrysalis poops out more because she's a queen and she can do that probably like an ant. I don't know. I don't know how changelings are kind of, kind of born. They don't go through that. They just kind of like, oh yeah, there were babies once and oh, well, they were crawling through her legs. Maybe that's how they're born. Maybe, I, I, I don't know. Maybe they secrete some sort of like fluidly liquid that, that I, I, I don't know. And I feel like I'm not qualified enough to talk about the, ma the, the making of baby process that change things go through. Maybe it's like an insect. How do insects do that thing? I don't know. I'm assuming it has eggs process. Maybe it's like a spider. That'd be really gross. Ew. Ew, ew. It's in, oh, it's in my head now. Oh, why? Why did I go down that path? Oh. Oh. Oh, I really hope it's not that. Yeah. I'm just going to assume that it it's like an ant or something where she just makes a bunch of babbies and just it's there and no i'm never gonna i'm not gonna tackle this subject again ever no nope, never again in fact i think i think it'd be better for all of us if we just wiped our memories of that just just get some brain bleach and just vigorously just, just vigorously scrub your brain just do it right now just just do it so it's all squeaky clean and shiny and then go find another channel that's better than this one <laughs> Oh, boy. Okay, so we've got 53 gems. I don't see what else we can do right now besides wait on the pie shop. So, how much more pies do we need, even? Four or five? Okay, we'll wait for one more. Oh, hey, look at that. I guess while we're doing that, we might as well get this out of the way beforehand. Alright. So, for our little friendship circle that people that added us... Here are their names. Little cake! Those little sponge cakes. You know, like, like, oh man, do you know those, like, little, little muffins? Little muffin packets they got? Like, they come in a big box and they're, like, all these different flavors, like the chocolate chip, the birthday cake. Although I didn't know, I didn't know birthday cake was a muffin type. But they got those birthday cake ones, they got the, the blueberry ones. They got all these different flavors. And I'm like, it's delicious. But I want little cakes of them. I think they have, like, little spice cakes, but not, like, an, a, an actual, like, cake. Like, 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 cupcakes. Or maybe they do. And I just missed out. I don't know. I mean, I love muffins. Don't get me wrong. I could eat my weight in muffins. Again, similar to, I think I made this analogy with chocolate. But, but I can't, like, that, like, it wouldn't be much. I weigh, like, maybe 130. Maybe. On a good day. But, uh... Yeah, no. Nah. Wouldn't be able to eat much of, what, much of those muffins. And I feel like I'd double my weight. And then I could eat more muffins. So, I mean, I guess it's a win-win for everybody. Alright, then we got Rainbow. Rainbow Dash with an Applejack logo. That's oddly fitting. Okay. I mean, I guess if, if they want Apple Dash to be a thing, that's fine. I don't care. I say whoever loves whoever, they just love them peoples. And, or, or in this case, horses. They can just love whoever. I don't care. Rainbow Dash wants to love Applejack. That's cool. Applejack wants to love Rainbow Dash secretly in her diary and, and mentions it, but never has enough courage to, to say what she feels. Because even though she's the young and honesty, she still has anxieties about, you know, relationships and all that. Because her parents are dead and she doesn't want to have to go through another relationship like that. And she doesn't want to have to have kids where she particularly dies or... Rainbow Dash dies because she's a Wonder Bolt and goes into action and then she dies? I mean, come on! That got a little too much. 
I really need to stop drinking caffeine before I start these. Then we got... Event to dance! I don't know, I... I, I kinda, I kinda strained my voice a little bit too much with the yelling, but yeah! Whatever the heck that means. And then we've got Randolph Cake! Good old Randolph Cake. Bring us back to reality here, where, you know, Apple Dash and... I don't even know what other that one was, but just pulling us on the fringe of reality. We're about to get sucked into a black hole. And we've got dusty pants. I mean, if your pants are dusty, you might want to dust them off. That's just kind of common courtesy. Then we've got Lotus Days. And Apple Pants. If Apple were to make pants that charged your phone in your pocket via wireless charger, how neat would that be? Did I just invent a thing? I really hope I didn't in just invent a thing and I could get money from it. But instead, I'm just going to sit here on YouTube just doing YouTube things. Gosh darn it, I really need to patent some of this junk. We've got Sunset Music. And then Violet Pants. And finally, Sapphire Pie. So cool. Thank you guys for adding me. At the end of the episode, I'll show you my friend's codes. So that way, you can you can add me. I should have done that at the end. But hey, you know what? Sh forget the rules. I do what I want. Alright. So anyway, since the pie is now done. The pie has been done baking in the oven. All we gotta do is get the cake. So I'll be back once those delicious cakes are in the oven and done. And uh, hopefully we'll have enough to also get the carrot cake, which then I'm going to probably sell for a fraction of the cost it was to make it. So, anyway, I'll be right back in a sec. Welcome back, guys. So, when we last left us, which was like two days ago or something like that, uh, we went and, and we're doing this. So, I finally got the last carrot cake. I got to go to uh, Sweet Apple Lake just to go get it. Um... Let me think, what else did I do? I did, I did, I did things. I can't, I can't even think. See, that's a pro- That's half the problem with this perfect formula I've come up with. I can't remember half the things I do half the time because I just have a horrible memory. But, I'm pretty sure I did something else too. I just don't, I can't think of it like off the top of my head right now. Uh, but I know I did something else. Okay, I've got that. Okay, yeah, there's, there's no other text box popping up. That's odd. Because usually with the with the hor horse the horse warming quests, <laughs> usually with the hearth warming quest, we usually get a pop up. But whatever, Pinky's got something to say. So as Snowfall checked out the amazing party while being invisible due to spirit magic, and by the way, she saw all the flowers and balloons and movies playing and started to think, hey. Maybe horse warming is actually kind of great. All right, so we need to produce movie passes, send Pinky to gaze at balloons, and produce dandelions in the flower shop. Okay, so I guess I gotta go to Ponyville and set somebody to work on this place. Okay, so you know what? I'm pretty sure I've got enough for you, right? No, oh, dang. Well, that's a big negative, but, uh, let me, let me see, who's not working? Oh, just those two. Cool, well, you're doing that, and is somebody, okay, you're doing that. Um, what else do we need? Oh, yeah, Pinky needs to stare at balloons all day. Where do you work, Pinky? I kind of forgot. Oh, yeah, the joke shop. Okay, cool. Well, you can take a break from that and stare at some balloons for whatever productive reason society thinks you need to do that. Alright, I feel like it was something in the Crystal Empire. But I can't think of it. Like, I'm like, did I, did I do something in the Crystal Empire? I don't think I did. I'm pretty sure I just worked on that one quest. And that was it. Oh, right, right, I forgot. I forgot, I got 64 stupid gems, yeah. Dang it, I'm an idiot. I didn't technically work on anything, I just got a lot of gems. A specific number of gems, and a number of gems I have an odd fascination with. 
So yeah, that, that that's an that's an oddity. Don't know why. Hi, Fode. How are you? Okay, so let's go get Ra Ra. I guess. I don't know why I need a carrot cake that will do no purpose. I'll travel to Sweet Apple Lake or spend 55 gems on a worthless piece of candy cake and then sell it. All right, there we go. We got that. She's here! She's here! She's finally here! Welcome to Sweet Apple Acres, Countess Color... Sven Gallop here, manager to the stars, and an unpleasantly surprised hello to you too! Pinkie Pie, I presume, Countess... I, I can't ever do this stupid name she's got. Color... I just can't. I, I don't know why. I know what it's supposed to say. I know how it's spelt. I just can't get my mouth to make the stupid syllables to make this work. So we're just gonna call her Countess Ra Ra, Queen of Space and Time. Set me ahead to ensure that the festivities or festival site meets her expectations. Yep, yeah, uh huh. I don't care. Yep, it's great. I know. We need Sven Gallop? Oh, oh, the whys. Oh, all the why. Oh, no. Oh. Okay. It's fine. I guess we'll take all our important ponies off of other tasks to do menial labor for Sven Gallop, the guy nobody likes. But it's okay! I don't mind! Not like they were doing anything important! It's okay! It'll be fine! Oh, it's just gonna be great! What all do I need? I need glasses. Okay, well you're doing something, so I guess I can't take you off that, but I can... Oh man, I gotta get- do I have Lucky Clover? I don't even think I have Lucky Clover. I don't have Lucky Clover. How much is it? Oh, why so much stuff? So many prerequisites to all the nonsense I can do. All for Sven Gallop! Nobody likes Sven Gallop. Nobody! I might as well get started working on color- I don't know. Yeah, go ahead and take her off that, because heaven only knows we don't need more gems in our life. It's not like we just spent 55 of them to get a stupid uh, cake that's totally worthless and does nothing. It's okay. All for Sven Gallop, the best pony ever. 100%. Forget all the other horses. It's okay. Sven Gallop is obviously the best horse. Okay, I just spent some money, so it's okay. We got Lucky Clover, though. So now Rarity can go dance her pants off, even though she doesn't wear pants, but she can go do that with him for whatever reason. It's okay. We needed more ponies anyway. So it's fine. Okay, so... Go do that thing. Y yes, just, just do it. Just do it. Go have fun. Be free. Be unproductive member of society like me. It's okay. I've you're learning from the best. Cause I am horribly, horribly unproductive in society. It's okay. Okay, I'm gonna try and sell this cake. Cause I don't like this stuff. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, well, it's going into the inventory because I don't care about it. I don't like it. It's stupid. And I don't want to look at it because it reminds me of Sven Gallop, who I just absolutely love. And totally doesn't remind me of family members in any way, shape, or form. Who the heck are you? Oh. You're not important to me. I'll do you later. Okay. So, now that that's done, um, you know what, you want to go to the Crystal Empire? Yeah, let's go to the Crystal Empire. I don't know how we're going to, you know what, I was going to try and get the, the magic shards. I'm thinking of just skipping it. Let me see how much the, how much gem cost that cost. Five. Uh, 
I mean, I guess the shop has a chance of dropping some, but that, who knows how long that would take. So do I want to spend my time or my money? Ah. Uh, I mean, nah, I don't care enough. Just do it. It's okay. I'll get more gems eventually. Okay, so let's see what Twiggles wants now. Those magic shards are really high quality, but we'll need to collect a few more if we're going to stand. Oh no, not again. The Crystal Empire. That Crystal Pony does too. Good thing he knows how to get into the Crystal Empire mine. Okay, so we gotta get the crystal metting game. Okay, cool. So we'll do that next time. Apparently something's going on where I have to talk to somebody, so I will be right back in a sec. Actually, you know what? Actually, actually, we're actually, like, good on time. So, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a fantastic day. I'm Ultramag64. Remember, whenever you're doing something with Spin Gallop, just make sure you really, really just, just, just don't do it. Sphingop's the worst. Unless he's your favorite, in which case... Explain why! I legitimately want to know! And happy gaming. I'll catch you guys on the flip side with more crazy content in the future. Oh! And if you haven't checked out the Mile Pony game from Gameloft just yet, then there's a link in the description down below for the iOS and Android version. And if you want to add me on Gameloft's sick cool web friend... Blah, blah, blah. What? Friends list thing, if you want to do that... Then, uh, my code is 0145. That's 0145. But, anyway guys, I'll catch ya on the flip side with more crazy content and ponies in the future. Bye bye